Am I crooked? Who knows? My whole setup is like balancing and now I put like a glass thing on. Oh man, this is stress. Alrighty then. I have filmed this intro so many times. Like my camera either stopped working. Um, I'm on my phone now because that was an issue. Um, I skipped a bunch of questions and forgot where I left off. It's, it's been a day. Today I'm going to be doing the TMI tag. It was pop popular on YouTube forever ago, like 2012, 2013. Uh, there is a 2016 version, so I'm gonna be doing that one. It is 2017, but you know, what are you gonna do when tags haven't been really a thing for years? The reason why I'm doing it is because I've been watching so many Kathleen Lights video and I saw her do this one today and I wanted to do it. That's all. Number one, what am I currently wearing? I am wearing a black shirt, blue jeans. I've been doing laundry and other chores of the sorts today, so really boring stuff. Number two, have I ever been in love? Yes. For sure. Um, I don't know how many times exactly because definitely, definitely my ex from senior year of high school, for sure. Junior, I thought I was, but like looking back. But yes, I've been in love. Did I ever have a terrible breakup? Yes, I have. I've had three terrible breakups. It's been a time. How old am I? I'm 19 years old. I'm a sophomore in college. I'm gonna be 20 in a couple months. Looking forward to that. Just being 19, it's like, I'm an adult, but I'm not, like, I'm a teen. I don't know. 19's not, not a fun age. How tall am I? I am 5'3". I'm the short friend. How much do I weigh? Um, it depends on the week. <laughs> Depends on how much I eat slash what I eat. Oh my god, college. Yeah, between like 100, 110, 115 if I eat ice cream for every meal. Do I have any piercings? I do. I have my doubles. And funny story. So I got the first one, sixth grade, second one, junior year of high school, like the summer. And then I got like one up here. Not the cartilage, but like in between. And it got crazy infected. Like crazy infected. It was an impulse piercing, but like I really wanted it. And it got infected, had to go on antibiotics. It lasted less than a week. And like, I know you're supposed to let it last, but like it was, it was infected. Do I have any tattoos? I do indeed. I got it um, a year ago about, and it is Morse code. It's on my ankle. It says hope. I love it. And, ooh, I'm gonna get another tattoo at some point um, on my hip, I think. I mean, it would be like a really good shoulder. Sh oh, it would be a really good shoulder tattoo, but I really want it on my hip. Um, I'm so excited. I really want it, but. My cousin gave me really good advice. She said, if you want a tattoo, um, wait a year, since it is going to be on your body for the rest of your life, you can wait a year. And so, like, as soon as I. Um, I got the ankle one, I was like, okay, ready for another one, but then I, I want to wait. So this is the one that I'm going to get next. I'm so excited. Um, and so I go to Whistler, Canada sometimes, and so I'm going to get two mountains, as in the Whistler Black Hill Mountains, and then like some of the flowers that I really like. I mean, this is just obviously a sketch. It's not important, but we had a lilac? Whatever, whatever tree that makes those flowers, gonna get that. And then the quote, miles to go. And I really want to get that in one of my grandparents' handwriting, but I can't decide whether I want my grandma or my grandpa. Sorry, whichever one I don't choose. What's my favorite drink? No brainer, absolutely no brainer. Um, <laughs> your mate, if you haven't had it, it's like really, really caffeinated tea. It comes in, comes in.
comes in this bottle. Um, this is the traditional, I either like the traditional or mint. And they also have cans, in which case I like the lemon or... I haven't had a can that I didn't like. Let's just go like that. Some of them are sparkling. These ones are just tea. Just really good. The dining halls on campus have been closed for Easter, so I haven't been able to get it, so I've just been drinking. This is my third cup of coffee today. Don't look at me. What's my favorite song? Um, I have no idea. Um, I would go through my Spotify, but I'm filming on my phone because my camera died. But, oh god, my favorite song. I couldn't, I couldn't tell. Zodiac sign. Um, I am a Cancer. I am such a Cancer. It's so ridiculous. I hate it. I mean, I don't hate it. So I'm obsessed with those, like, Tumblr, what's your sign kind of tags or text posts or whatever. I'm gonna put, like, a couple of them up that I really enjoy. I'm just, I'm just always a Cancer, no matter, no matter what. Um, how long does it take me to shower? Ten minutes, give or take what I'm doing in the shower, like, if I need to shave slash scrub. Around ten minutes, give or take. What's my favorite show? Gilmore Girls. Oh my god, it's Gilmore Girls. Um, I'm watching it for the ninth time. I just started it a couple nights ago. Um, but yeah, I've seen it all the way through eight times. When the new four episodes, the seasons, You're in a Life, whatever, came out um, Thanksgiving night, me and my friend Camille, we just watched all of them. I was up till six in the morning because like they're four hour and a half episodes. Camille fell asleep. I was drinking coffee, so I stayed up till 6 in the morning and then just kind of slept the day Black Friday. What are my favorite bands? This one is so much easier to answer than um, the favorite song because just bands have a lot of songs and if I like the band then I probably like their songs. Get ready for 2007. I love Panic at the Disco, Fall Out Boy, um, Mayday Parade. I just went to their concert. Oh my god, it was so good. I saw them once before. I just take me back. I want to go again. Um, I also have been loving um, John Bellion and Tipo Campus and Toke. If you know Streetlight Manifesto, Toke is their lead singer, and so he sings like acoustic versions of Streetlight Manifesto songs. It's good. It's good. Something I really miss. Um, I'm gonna do someone's someone. My dog's a someone. Um, my little baby. She's in Florida with my family. This is her. She's just like a little floopy white dog. And I love her. Um, she has the most personality I've ever seen on a dog. It's it's wild. Like, she is a person. She gets mad at us. She, like, when she gets a haircut, she just got a haircut. She cries about it, and she's annoyed, and she's, like, embarrassed that she got a haircut. I don't know. One time she like sat under the couch and like, she doesn't howl, but she was just like, oh, cause she, she hates her haircuts and it's so funny. But she gets like super shaggy if she doesn't get one, so sorry. Where do I go when I'm sad? <sighs> okay, it depends how sad. I usually just hide in my room. But if it's like one of those sads where like I need to get out and do something, then I just kind of go downtown and like window shop um, listen to music on the bus, or if it's like really nice outside, then I walk, but like, Seattle, so it's usually a little drizzly, so I take the bus. If I'm in Canada, which never happens, but like, this sticks out to me. There is a boulder outside of the, like, hotel condo that we stay at, out the back door, and like, climb up the little rocks, and then like, around the side of the building, it's just this great boulder and you just like look at the I go in the summer so like it's not a ski hill in the summer clearly but just I just look over it and sometimes there are bears on the hill and it just I like it how long does it take to get ready in the morning this one depends cuz I can totally get ready in like three minutes I have done it before when my alarm went off for hey you need to leave your house now and go to class instead of like, wake up, this is the, okay, leave. 
Um, so yeah, I can get ready in like three minutes, but realistically, I get up early so I can take my time. I can take like 45 minutes to an hour and a half, um, but like I don't need that time. I just like it. I drink my coffee, slowly get ready, watch YouTube or listen to music. It's a nice little routine. Have I ever been in a physical fight? No. What turns me on? I don't know, like, good sense of humor or, like, passion for something? I don't know. Like, I'm not going to be attracted to you if you were, like, a boring person with boring aspirations. What turns me off? That kind of goes hand in hand. Like, if you're not an interesting person, why would I be attracted to you? Oh, also, okay. I'm not a gun person. I hate guns. And if you're like anti-feminist, anti-human rights, no. One guy on Tinder, his bio was like, if you don't like country music, this probably isn't gonna work out. And I was like, yep, no it's not. Quality you look for in a partner. I'm like answering all of these in the same thing. Like, humor. If you're an interesting person with like interesting aspirations, like you gotta be passionate about something, you know? gotta like something like some of my exes have been like really into art or like music or like I don't know it's worked out or no it like you you know what I'm saying what's my favorite color it depends on my mood ah um behind me is my bed and it's kind of like grays and like muted colors I gotta say muted colors um mostly cool muted colors so like light blues and purples and grays yeah loud music or soft loud almost almost entirely loud um if i'm going to sleep i usually sometimes no i don't usually do anything but sometimes i really like listening to music as i'm falling asleep in which case soft like toke he does really good like falling asleep falling asleep musics oh my god Clarence saw I haven't listened to them in forever but they have such a good really soft album and I miss them favorite quote oh god I don't know behind me over there I have some quotes I really like um thou shall not take shit that's a good one Ooh. okay Leslie Nope quote I have the most valuable commodity in America the blind stubborn belief that what I what I am doing is right. That one I kind of live by. I'm a very stubborn person. And I believe what I'm doing is right, so like. Favorite actor, Josie Gordon-Levitt. <laughs> Reason I joined YouTube, I wanted to do vlogmas. And plus I just spend all of my time watching YouTube videos, so might as well make some sometime. Do I have any fears? What are they? I mean, I do. I obviously have fears. Um, I'm afraid of driving, sort of. Like, I love driving, but, like, I can't drive on the freeway because I got in a, like, pretty bad car accident. Um, like, I wasn't hurt. Nobody in the car was hurt. Thank God. Um, but the car was pretty beat up. Um, we hydroplaned. I'm just, like, afraid of driving because of that embarrassment. <laughs> like, I am, yeah, I don't know. Driving is the main one, but, like, obviously there are, like, little things that it's the last thing that made me cry music I don't know I was having like an off day I was just like listening to sad music from high school and just having a time the one before that though watching 13 reasons why on Netflix oh man I still haven't finished it because I binged the first 11 episodes at the same time and I was just like going through it emotionally and so I'm saving the last two for when I just like when I can handle it meaning behind my YouTube name my birth given name last time you said I loved someone okay besides like my friends it's been a while it's like over a year ago Jesus but like friends and family it's been like within the week. Last book I read. I don't know. It's it's a book for class. Maybe American Psycho? <laughs> That's an interesting book to say. It's the last book I read. No, 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 no. I read 
two biographies over the summer. I read um, Alexander Hamilton, not the one that the musical is based on, but like another one, and then a Hillary Clinton one. Haven't read many interesting books recently. Book I'm currently reading, I have so many open. Oh my goodness, I need to sit down and finish it, but that's gonna be a summertime activity when I'm not, actually I'm taking a full course load this summer, so let's see if I ever read another book. Um, I have The Bell Jar open, and I have Milk and Honey open, and I just purchased 1984, so I am looking forward to reading all of those. Last show I watched, Gilmore Girls. I started it again for like the ninth time a couple nights ago. Last place I was. I don't really know what that means here, <laughs> I guess. Last like trip I had, I got my wisdom teeth out in Florida because that's where my family is. And that was a couple, like a month ago, about a month ago I was in Florida. But I mean, it wasn't a fun trip by any means. Last sport I played, nah. Who's the last person I talked to? My friend Annie. We texted because we're gonna get dinner tonight. Last song I sang, <laughs> I had Mr. Brightside on this morning, so Mr. Brightside. Favorite chat up line? Chat up, chat up line? Hey, how's it going? Uh, or just like sending someone a meme starting a conversation that way. Do I have a crush? I don't think so. Sort of. A little bit. Relationship between you and the last person you texted. Annie, she's like my birthday buddy. Um, she's one of my best friends. We met during summer orientation and um, her birthday is the day before mine. And so, yeah, made plans to get dinner. Favorite food, pasta. Any kind of pasta, any kind of noodles actually, like whether it be pad thai or like chow mein or just like Italian pasta. Noodles. Place I want to visit. So many. I want to go to Italy. I want to go to Italy so badly. Um, I went to Rome for like a couple hours this summer <laughs> because we were on a boat and so we just like stopped there for like a couple hours. Oh my god, I want to go back. I love pasta, I love everything about it, and just, I wanna go to Italy. But like also, Greece, and Ireland, and I wanna go to Brighton, because like, YouTubers live there, and just, oh my god, Amsterdam, and I wanna go back to Canada, and I wanna go to New Jersey to finish, visit my grandparents, and DC, because I haven't been since I was 12, and, I want to see the Grand Canyon, but like I want to do one of those Parks and Rec April and Andy things where they just like decide to go to the Grand Canyon in the middle of the night. When's the last time I kissed someone? When's the last time I kissed someone? Actual kiss was in January. Yep. Last time I was insulted. Um. Insulted? I don't. I mean, I get insulted, but like, I don't remember the last time. Um, this, this person on Facebook has been really like annoying me to my core because like they are like very anti-feminism, like a very anti-feminist. I'm like, do you even understand? And like, they voted for Trump and I'm just like, <laughs> why are you like that? So it's like not insulted, but like just at my core, I'm like, why? Favorite flavor of sweet? I don't know, I've been digging my eggs, but like also chocolate has been like, chocolate. What instruments do I play? Um, I play the ukulele really badly, um, but it's kind of fun, just like strumming along. I used to play piano when I was very, very little. Friends with my piano teacher on Facebook. She's doing well. Favorite piece of jewelry? I don't know. Um, some of my earrings I really like. I don't know. I don't have like favorite pieces of jewelry. I just got this little ring for my right hand on Amazon and it's super cheap and it fits and I like it. I do have a really nice like 
bangle like cuff bracelet and it says what she tackles she conquers and so it's a quote from Richard Gilmore about Rory about like what she tackles she conquers I like that one have I ever used it what the kind of question is that like I don't even what last time you hung out with anyone oh my god that was a good week ago oh my goodness yeah it was one of my best friends Phoebe um former roommate love you so much um her birthday was on the 10th so we all hung out my friend Michelle came up from Portland and we all just like got chicken and waffles went to Cary Park it was just it was a fun time and I don't think I've really hung out with anyone since <sighs> yep who should answer these questions next tag them um of my millions of friends on YouTube um I'm gonna tag summer summer answer these questions go for it all right I hope you enjoyed this video it was much longer than my usual videos um which might be a good thing I don't know be sure to subscribe I put out new videos occasionally and give this video a thumbs up if you like my tag videos I don't know all 16 of my subscribers thank you all right